You can climb the school wall towards the Rosehawk Hill in this way. Count the fence from the left and try to jump over the seventh and eighth fence. So here's the wall. Now let's count the fences from the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. As it said, we would be able to jump from the seventh and eighth fence. Let's try. Seventh fence, pass. Eighth fence, pass. An easy way to spot these fences is to look at these black marks. The fences in front of the third black mark are the seventh and eighth. Hence, the myth is confirmed. After the new update, you won't get knocked if you jump from a tall building or even if you jump from a vehicle with high speed. Let's try this by jumping off from here. As you can see, we're still left with around 10 HP. Now let's try it with a fast moving vehicle. As you can see, we didn't get knocked and are left with around 10 HP. Hence, the myth is confirmed. Go prone near a wall, now change to FPP and use any healing. You can see through the wall. To try this, let's go prone near a wall. Now we'll change to FPP. Now we'll start healing. As you saw, we're able to look through the wall. This happens because the character moves slightly towards the left while healing, so the camera angle moves and goes out of the wall. Hence, the myth is confirmed. If you don't have any weapon, double tap on your weapon slot and that will say, I need a weapon. Let's try this. As soon as I tap on the weapon slot, it says, I need a weapon. I also came upon some more cool features of the Universal Mark, such as, if you need any specific ammo, hold the preferred weapon and select I need ammo from the Universal Mark. If you're short of any attachments, again hold the preferred weapon and select I need attachments. You can also ask for a helmet, vest, or bag by tapping on these. You can mark anything by simply looking at it and pressing the universal mark. Vehicles and crates can also be marked in this manner. Hence, the myth is confirmed. Damages of weapons are different in TDM as compared to the classic mode. Let's try this using two weapons. Firstly, using M416. This is the TDM version, and this is the classic version. Below are the health bars of the enemy. As you can see, the damage is different. Now let's try it with a car 98. As you can see, the damage is different. Hence, the myth is confirmed. If you are laying behind the crate of an enemy and your head is exactly behind it, you won't get a headshot because the bullet doesn't pass through the crate. Here's a crate and our enemy would be laying behind it. Now let's try to take a shot. As you can see, we're clearly able to hit the target. Hence, the myth is busted. When you take off the hair of Sarah and again put it on, the hair converts into a deer-like headgear. Let's change our character to Sarah. Now let's open the bag and try throwing her hair. As you can see, the hair changes into a different headgear. Hence, the myth is confirmed. In the anniversary mode, you won't get shot if you're sitting on the launcher or behind the AKM statue. Secondly, you cannot fire at someone who is gliding using the launcher. First, let's try sitting on the launcher. As you can see, the enemies are unable to hit us. Now let's try the same behind the AKM statue. Again, they're unable to hit us. Hence, the myth is confirmed. Now let's come to the second myth, which said you cannot fire at someone who is gliding. Here's our enemy. Let's try to finish him. 
As you can see, we were successfully able to finish it. Hence, the myth is busted. Turn FPP to TPP while throwing a nade. Then, see a new animation. Let's change to FPP and start cooking a nade. As soon as we're about to throw it, we'll change to TPP. As you can see, the character does a funny throwing action. Hence, the myth is confirmed. You can climb on most of the walls and containers in TDM. Just go near a wall, hold a weapon, and press the jump button. Let's try this. We'll hold a weapon and try to climb on some walls and containers. As soon as I press on the jump button, our character is easily able to climb over many objects. Hence, the myth is confirmed. Here's a bonus 